Hello, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to Grand Theft Auto San Andreas The Definitive Edition. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the achievement Not A Player, and the description is, go on at least one date with every potential girlfriend. So, the footage that you're seeing in the background is of me doing the second story-related girlfriend. While that's rolling, I'm just going to talk about the first story-related girlfriend, which I'm sure you all probably know. So Denise is the first girlfriend you'll get. You'll get her in the mission Burning Desire. Um, upon completing that mission, you will have the girlfriend Denise back near Grove Street. She'll be the first girlfriend you'll have, and you should have all got her if you've progressed the story enough. It is pretty much at the start of the game, so I'm pretty sure you'll know what I'm talking about with this one. All you've got to do is take her on one date. It doesn't have to be a successful date. None of these dates with these girls have to be successful. You just have to take them all on at least one day each for the achievement. So now I've got that one out of the way, I'll talk about the footage that's rolling in the background. So the one in the background is for the girl Millie. And this is part of the mission Key to Her Heart, which is part of the heist um, side missions for Woozy at the Four Dragons Casino once you get to Los Venturas. Once you finish this mission, you will have Millie as a girlfriend and you will either need to kill her to get a key card or get to 35 to 40 percent of her liking you to get the key card so all you need to do is get her as a girlfriend after this mission take her on a date and then you can either kill her to get the key card or you can date her and get 35 to 40 percent and get the key card but we're focusing on the girlfriend stories at the moment so that's a separate thing so that's how you get Millie and Denise. So I'm not going to cover those at all for the rest of the video. That's how you do them. It's pretty self-explanatory. The other four girlfriends are all available while you're free roaming the world. So I'm going to go into more detail with those. I just kind of glossed over these two here because I'm pretty sure most people will have already got these two. Or they will get to a point in the story where they will know what I'm talking about. And then they'll have access to these two. So... I'm going to cut to the first free room girlfriend now and explain what's going on. Okay, so this is the first fully optional girlfriend. She's available here around the back of this ammunition. She's called Helena. Um, to have her as a girlfriend, you'll need low fat, low muscle and high sex appeal. Um, and once you've got her as a girlfriend, she will be available to pick up from her house between 8 in the morning and 12 o'clock lunchtime and then two in the afternoon till two in the morning. So each of these girlfriends has a specific want from CJ, meaning they'll he will need to be a certain fat or thin, have a certain muscle mass or no muscle. But a good way to completely bypass all of this is to collect all 50 oysters. It might sound like an annoying task, but it's really not that bad. I do have a guide on the channel for where all the 50 oysters are. And in my opinion, it's much easier than getting fat and thin and muscly and not muscly and messing around with all that. Um, I think it's a lot easier to get the 50 oysters than it is to do all that, but it is completely up to you. I will tell you the stats that you'll need for each girlfriend. But if I were you, I would pause the video now, check out my oyster guide, collect all of those, and um, basically any girl you approach will just fancy you no matter what your stats are which make this a hell of a lot easier but that is completely up to you if you are going for 100% completion um, you will need to collect the oysters anyway so if that's something you're going to do I would definitely recommend doing this after you've done that as it just makes it a lot easier as I said though this is uh, a guide on just doing the girlfriends so it is up to you how you want to do it I just thought it was definitely worth mentioning that because it can be annoying getting fat and then thin and then muscly and not muscly and all that stuff. So do it whichever way you like. I just thought it'd be worth mentioning. So yeah, this is Helena and um, we're going to move on to the next one now. All right, so the next girlfriend is located here on the golf course, just to the left of the driving school. This one's called Katie. She requires you to have high muscle or high sex appeal and you can meet her at her house after you've done this and she agrees to go out with you between 12 in the afternoon or 12 lunchtime and 12 o'clock midnight so she's available all day at her house 
in the location that I'm showing on the map just here. So again, you'll need high muscle and sex appeal to grab her, or you will need to have collected the oysters like I mentioned just a second ago. Hey Carl. Babe. Also, just hey, like Carl. to mention again that you don't have to have a successful date with any of these girls, you just have to meet the requirements to take them out, and then just take them out once, and that'll count towards the achievement. So we're gonna go straight on to the next one now. All right, so here we are at the driving school. This is for the girl, Michelle, and to get her to agree to go out with you, you're gonna need to be fat, 50% fat, or you can actually just have 90% or higher sex appeal and she will agree to take you out. Again, I would just recommend get, grabbing the oysters, um, but they, they are the requirements for taking Michelle out. Once she's agreed to take you out, um, you can pick her up from her house downtown between midnight and 12 o'clock in the day so half the day there and that's where you can grab her from just on the map there so that's michelle done and uh, we're going to move on to the next one all right so this is the last fully optional girlfriend um the first two you get in missions this is the last one of the ones that are out in the open world and you can grab them whenever uh, she's called Barbara, and to get her to take you out or agree to go out with you, you need to be fat or have maximum sex appeal. So again, this is why I mentioned the oysters. You're going to be fat and then thin, skinny, muscly. It's an absolute nightmare. Um, it just takes time. But again, collecting the oysters takes time. But as I've said multiple times, if you're going to get the 100%, just get the oysters before you do this. It makes it a hell of a lot easier. Anyway... Once she's agreed to take you out, you can pick her up from the police station here between midnight and six o'clock in the morning. So once you've done these, you can do them in any order, but once you actually get out of the last date, your achievement will unlock. And that is going to do it for this video. I'm going to cut to the stat menu at the end just to show you the stats of what it looked like when I'd done it and the achievement had unlocked. Other than that, there's nothing else to say about this one so thanks for stopping by as always drop me a like if it helped subscribe for more achievement guides as i've mentioned multiple times i have 100 percent in this game now and i've got a guide for absolutely everything required for 100 percent completion and i've also got a guide for every single achievement in the game so be sure to check out the channel if there's anything you're missing or anything you're unsure about or if you're just not sure what's required for 100 percent i've got a guide on everything so, as always, thanks for stopping by, and I will see you in the next one.